Hello guys, today we are doing the second season, so let's get into it, let's cue that intro. Oh no, and welcome back to the PSV career mode, it's me Dan back again, and today we are going to be doing some transfers today, as uh, we need to do some objectives and stuff like that. So just before we start, I just want to say thank you guys for the recent likes and comments recently, and I just want to say thank you to all new subscribers for subscribing, so thank you guys for that as well. And if you haven't yet hit the subscribe button, please hit that subscribe button, as it does really help, and don't forget to like the video as well. So thank you guys for that. So... Uh, let's quickly show you the new objectives that we've got to do uh, for this season. So um, we have to sign three players under the age of 20, which is annoying. Uh, so we will do that. Um, we'll do that in this in today's video. Hopefully, fingers crossed, if one of the players counts towards that. Uh, f yeah, fingers crossed we should. And then for brand exposure, we just got to get uh, 15 games. We get a, well, we've got to score at least one goal in 15 games, which is, uh, you know, pretty easy. Uh, fingers crossed we'll be able to do that. And we've got to sign three players born in Asia, which I'll do off screen. Uh, or Basically, you, you just got to sign like random players uh, from the Asian leagues. So could be anyone. Um, so I'll, I'll do that off. Uh, I'll do that off screen, and we'll get them. Uh, we'll probably release them as well, like we normally do. Uh, we've got to win the Champions League, um, which I didn't expect us to get a you know win the cup. But um, yep, <laughs> we've got to win the Champions League, and obviously we've got to win the league title and win the cup. And then uh, obviously uh, financial hasn't changed. We've got to make a profit of two point six million. So. Uh, looking at the team, I've already gone ahead and made decisions on what we're going to do. So obviously, uh, main thing is we're going to sign a new goalkeeper. I think it's pretty simple. Uh, Benitez won't be our goalkeeper. Uh, so there's that. And then the two places I am looking at for the first team is that Homozo, Soler and Benitez. I was thinking about maybe getting rid, rid of... Adi Amy or Xavi Simons, but I think what I might do is put Adi Amy on the right and then put Xavi Simons in that second team maybe and then just sign a world-class left winger. Uh, but then I thought, you know what, I'll just keep them as they are. You know, they're both growing. You know, we'll keep switching them like we do anyway. And obviously at the moment, Xavi Simons is an 84, so he's ahead of Adi Amy so far. Um, but yeah, I am looking to change the uh, second team just a bit. We're going to bring in a new centre back, and we're going to change. Uh, we've changed Veerman to a CDM already. Uh, he changed to a CDM quite quickly. It was only two weeks, so that was pretty much done. So we just need to get a centre midfielder. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and look at the transfers. So obviously, Bellingham makes sense. Um, you know, hopefully he'll count towards the. Um, hopefully he'll count towards the uh, under the age of twenty. I was going to sign Pedri, but you know, can't keep signing the same players. <laughs> um, and then Old Black, you know, pretty simple. You know, goalkeeper. He'll be better than he'll be our goalkeeper uh, for the rest of the, you know for the rest of the career mode. Obviously, he'll replace um, Walter Benitez. Even though we should keep Benitez, but you know. Below is now an 82, so I was thinking about keeping Below and then swapping the two, but I thought, you know, we're going to be in the Champions League. We need a good goalkeeper, and Old Black, you know, I just thought, of, just thought, I just thought of Old Black to be honest. Um, and then the two players I was looking at was Antonio Silva. Hopefully, he's an 80, 81, something like that, just to replace, you know, Sotalo or something like that. And obviously, Pablo Gavi just to uh, replace Bosca Boscagli in that centre midfield. And then, um, yeah, Sven Botman. Why not? <laughs> From Newcastle. Um, he's an 86. He looks pretty good. Um, so, yeah, I think it's a pretty, it was a pretty simple swap with, um, what's his name? Uh, Mario Hermoso. So, let's get the first team, you know, let's get the first team uh, transfers done and then we'll do the second team transfers. Uh, right, so yeah, goalkeeper for goalkeeper, Walter Benitez, let's give them a goalkeeper in return. 
And let's just start off with 60 million. They probably want a bit more than that. Uh, they do want Walter Benita, so that's good. Uh, but let's just get that down to 74. Are we? Yeah, obviously we got. Um, I think we had 300 million, uh, 400 million in the transfer budget, so that should get these uh, transfers done. So let's see if we can do that. Um, so yeah, crucial. Yeah, so we are swapping Carlos Soler with uh, what's his name as well. Um, uh, Bellingham. Yeah, I'm swapping. Soler for Bellingham, just because he's the lowest rated uh, centre midfield. And I was thinking about, you know, maybe putting what's his name in the second team, Soler, but I thought, you know what, let's just get Gavi in. I know he's under the age of 20. Um, so another one that we always seem to sign. And hopefully in in the new uh, EAFC 24, they get rid of that uh, objective to sign three players under the age of 20 because it's, it's good if you're doing like five, six year... Um, career mode but I only do you know I only do two seasons in a career mode so and then right if if we do do a third season it would you know be a random one um right so yeah midfielder Carlos Soler and it's gonna cost us an arm and a leg so let's go let's go 70 plus Carlos Soler just to start off with 80 million you know what um let's just do meet and middle do 75, you should do that. Yeah, there we go. Uh, probably could have got him for much cheaper. For Be but for Bellingham, that's, you know, pretty simple. I was thinking about signing like an English goal centre-back because obviously he'll be the only English player at the club. But, um, you know, signing Jude Bellingham is Jude Bellingham, isn't it? Uh, and obviously, in real life, he's just signed for Real Madrid. So, yeah, he's got a bright future at Real Madrid. He's got the number five as well. At Real Madrid, uh, he probably wants some money, so let's give him ninety thousand. Yep, uh, probably overpaid there as well, but that's fine. And hopefully, he'll count towards the um, thingamajig under the age of twenty. If he doesn't, then obviously, oh, he does. So there we go. Um, I was gonna say, if he doesn't, then we'll <laughs> then we'll um, sort it out in a later date. So. Uh, yeah, so let's put Bellingham in there, and there we go. So there's straight swap with Carlos Soler, and uh, let's do Botman next. So he's straight swap with Homozo Again, I was thinking about putting Homozo in the second team, but we've got Van der Ven, you know, we've got Sotalo. Uh, well, we're going to be swapping Sotalo, but we're keeping Van der Ven, but, you know... Um, Hermoso is 28. He ain't going to grow anymore. So we need to get a younger centre-back and obviously a better centre-back, which is Sven Botman. Uh, let's go with 45. Let's see if they'll accept that. And they will. Probably just overpaid for him, but that's fine. Um, we've got the money, so there we go. Uh, let's see if we can get him in. So he probably wants a huge contract like Bellingham. I've got to do a load of contracts as well. Um, a load of players want new contracts, unfortunately. Uh, let's just go with 80,000. Yep, yeah, there we go. He accepts that, so that's good. Um, and then the next one... The next one is... Who is it? It is... Hang on. It is... Oh, I think it's just the two players, isn't it? So let's put... Uh, what's his name? Into the yeah, Botman. There we go. So save changes, and we got obviously all our loan players back as well. Right, uh, Antonio Silva. So this is the one I'm a bit worried about because I don't know what their role, what their, um, what their overall is. But fingers crossed, they're pretty much the same. Um, so Sotalo, I know plus twenty million. Let's see if they accept that. Yep. So Sotalo plus twenty two million. We'll accept that. So there we go. Let's get him in. And the same for Pedri. Probably is like an 81, 82. Um, he normally is in the second season. Uh, he wants rotation, which is good. Um, five years as he's only 19. And uh, he doesn't want a lot of wages, but we'll give him a bit. we we'll give him a bit of wages because why not? We've got the money. We have got the money. So there we go. Right, so on to the next guy, which is, um, what's his name? What is his name? 
yeah, overpaid there, I think. Good price. What is his overall? Oh, he's an 82. There we go. Even better. <laughs> and it does count towards the under the age of 20. And then same thing with Gavi, um, Pablo Gavi. So we'll see if they'll do a straight swap with Boscagli. And let's do 30 million because they probably... Oh, there we go. 30 million plus um, just a sell-on clause for Boscagli. And in you go, Gavi. He wants rotation. And again, you know... Uh, oh, he wants five years anyway. Um, hopefully, again, you know, he wants a bit... Oh, that's fine. He Hopefully, you know, he's like an 81, 82, something like that. He will grow because obviously he's only 18. So let's get him into the midfield. Well, that second team midfield. Right, what overall is he? Oh, he, he's an 82 as well. So, so there we go. So pretty much, um, pretty much what we said, really. Uh, and he is an 82, so there we go. So um, we could put, yeah, let's put Silver there and Gavi in, in there. So there we go. Save changes to that. I still haven't changed. We still haven't changed, um, what's his name, to a right back, Frimpong. It just won't change for some reason. Uh, right, so yeah, there we, there we go. Um, we've done the youth development now, so we've done our signings. Um, I don't think we will sign. I was thinking about it. I don't think we'll sign anyone because I think Lorente and Makoko and Adiemi are good for that second team and Chavi Simons as well is good. So I think we're done all over the board unless we, you know, get a... Oh, I need to sort out this uh, second team, don't I, as well. Um, unless we get someone like... Uh, uh, yeah, should we put... Ben oh, actually, no, let's put uh, Katrina in there. Um, unless we get someone who is uh, good as well. Um, but I, I don't know what we're doing, to be honest. <laughs> let's see. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Um, why is Fringpom playing there? Oh, we need our new centre-back, don't we? Uh, Silver. There we go. So in, in he goes Silver. And it looks a bit better, that second team. So there we go. And just hope that these players grow. Fingers crossed they will. Right, so that is going to be it for today, guys. Next episode, I shall... Um, well, we get through the most of the summer. Um, we'll do the new contracts as well. Well, we've only got, what, a month before we've got our first game, actually. Um, we probably won't play our first game. Um, we, yeah, we we'll probably won't play our first couple of games. We'll play the Super Cup against Man City. Um, and that will probably be the next episode. So look forward to that one then, guys. So anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today. So please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. So right, guys, I'm going. Bye.